It's one of my favorites. Definitely got a better shape. <sighs> First day I started walking and stuff, I took a bunch of stops. The heat was pretty overwhelming. Now it's like, it's still like 90. Uh, you know, high 90s like it was, but I can just make it in one swoop. I have a lot more uh, endurance, a lot more stamina. I was pretty out of shape before. Pretty good shape now. Not definitely nowhere near where I could be, but, um, you know, I could just walk to campus 25 blocks, 25 blocks back without uh, taking a break in each half. It's pretty good. So, I don't know, I'm 
just waiting for my tax return. And once I get that, hopefully in a week or two, um, I'll get the van fixed. Probably stay in a motel for a few days. It shouldn't take too long. I'm take it to the uh, transmission specialist, Cunningham Brothers, that uh, kept my van for a few days without a storage fee. So I'll get it, get it done and then probably head to Austin and start figuring out uh, how that area is and then um, you know try to find the office for the new community tiny house housing see if there's an office set up there and just try to get a tour try to get as much information as possible try to get as you know make sure I'm on the waiting list and get ready for that and that's probably gonna be my next move is uh, starting to rent one of those new community tiny houses pretty much been a dream of mine since I learned about sustainability and I learned about tiny houses and, um, you know, I thought the modern size, average size home was pretty stupid. It's pretty wasteful unless you have a full family and every room in your house is, is used and every space in your house is used. You know, even the outdoor spaces like around your house and stuff like that. Part of your property is used and what's the point of having owning anything you're not going to use it. So, that's the point. 